today's video I'm going to give uh, my review and my thoughts on the Honest Company. Um, I've been using their, their range um, for a while, since before Aerie was born. So, um, I remember before she was born I was specifically looking for, you know, what's the best for your baby? I, I was trying to find the best for her in my opinion what I thought and like the safest things um, helping the environment taking care of her staying away from toxins chemicals just things that should not be allowed to be put close to humans um, and my friend I remember my one friend she had already been using them and she told me she had a subscription through them and stuff so I was like oh well let me try let me just look 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 into it so I did and I decided I would go with the subscription and um, I love it I've been doing it ever since and honest customer service is outstanding outstanding I've had um, today for instance my package just came today with my new month stuff that's why I was really excited and I thought let me just do this I've been wanting to do it so let me just look at the products. Some new products I've never tried before and some that I've been using. So, um, but one of my bags of, one of these bags of wipes or packs of wipes was missing. Which is very uncommon to have issues like that. I don't think that's ever happened to me before. But I just gave them a call and the lady I spoke with, what was her name? I can't remember. I feel bad, I wish I remembered. Um, but she was so not, maybe it was Monique? I don't know. She was um, lovely to talk to and she was so apologetic. Said she's going to send a new one right over. I told her it was, you know, it wasn't a super big problem. I just realized they weren't in the, in the box. But she was amazing. I did also, before, when she was quite young, I had, I remember I had a batch of nappies. Um, when I pulled the, those things. Whatever they're called. The little side thing that you pull open to, you know, keep the nappy on. And it just pulled right off. And I thought, that's so strange. And it happened to another two in that actual um, pack. So I gave them a, um, a call, or I might have used the chat service. And they were also super apologetic and sent me right over a new replacement, a whole new replacement bag. Uh, I just gave them, you know, the details of that bag and stuff. Um, but otherwise, I haven't really, it's not like they have issues all the time. Just my experience with the customer service has been really incredible. So, nappies. First of all, you've probably seen them. Um, I'm just doing this because I like the company and, yeah, that's why. Because I like this stuff. Oh, so when I was, yeah, at first you'd like look on, I remember looking on YouTube, trying to find people's actual thoughts and reviews and I really didn't find one super helpful or and I didn't really find one that was just from the honest point of view so that's why I'm doing this. Um, although I haven't looked for a while there may be new videos. Um, they're quite thin and stuff. Um, yeah they're really nice. Okay leaking and stuff I've not had a problem. The only times I ever had problems was when I needed to size up and that was twice um, when she was a newborn and then I think from the three month size whatever size that was so maybe size one when I needed to go to size two um, she had what they called a blowout um, she just had I mean I don't know very few like maybe five ever um, and I didn't know what to do. I was like, this is so weird because I remember that she, her nappies were doing so, so well. And all of a sudden, it wasn't holding it in anymore. And I thought, what's happening? So I called the honest company or maybe I emailed them asking them, you know. And they suggested um, sizing up. And as soon as I did that, the problem went away. So where I had some friends who constantly had these blowouts. Um, yeah, I mean... Mm -mm. terrible stories poo everywhere so I was really grateful not to have that so I did not have issues with that um, nappy rashes I feel like we don't really have that many nappy rashes where I do have a lot of friends who don't use the honest company and they say their kids have nappy rashes just almost constantly um, so from my experience we don't really battle with rashes although a tip I do use their, their um, bottom cream 
But I also, I found that the, I think the pediatric, whoever, someone told me, and it does really help. If you put, um, when you bath your baby, you put a little bit of baking soda in and it just clears up the rashes, which 100% definitely helped get any nappy rash away very quickly. But I also use the nappy rash cream. Um, so what else do I think about the nappies? Yes, stunning. I don't battle with leaks. I don't battle with blowouts. Um, obviously they're super cute. Although I did try last my last order, I got one pack of only the white, and that was cute too. But uh, I do like the patterns, and just the fact that I really do trust them. I trust the ingredients. Um, I trust that they are eco-friendly. All these kinds of things. I mean, I really try in every way to, you know, take care of the environment, take care of us. That's why I usually buy um, pretty much only organic stuff, just because I feel like that's the, the best that I can do for my family. I'm not saying if you don't do that, you're not doing the best for your family, but just me personally, that's a choice um, that I make. And um, so I'm trying, I'm trying. But yes, uh, would I recommend them? 100%. 100%. Um, yeah, these are pandas. Super cute. So that's all their nappies. Um, I love them. So then, moms. This, this is not new. I've had this for quite a while. But this organic nipple balm. Absolutely stunning. Um, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I did try, I think at the hospital they gave me a sample of something else. Um, but this stuff is was just the best stuff um, compared to the other samples that I tried. 100% incredible. This hand sanitizer spray, the lavender, I always have bought the lavender. I um, I really like it, it smells fantastic and I use it all the time. I just put it in my bag after the shops or you know wherever, I just spritz some and then make sure it's clean. This it's almost finished actually. This is the, the new range, the almond range. Um, I have two of their products with the almond range. The bubble bath, which I just tried tonight because I just got this, uh, smells incredible. And it makes lovely, lovely bubbles. And I had speaking with someone else who does not use the Honest Company fully, but um, does I think use their bubble bath, has said it's one of the only companies that they found that makes like a safe um, or you know safe healthy bubble bath that actually makes bubbles where they said they've tried other brands that you know claim to be safe and stuff which they probably are but they don't really make bubbles and they the, the honest company's bubbles really make really make bubbles um, oh yeah but this this one um, the same range the new range which is more moisturizing it smells so good it's a sweet almond I use this on myself every single day David doesn't really like it because I think it's a little bit of a girly scent. It's just a sweet scent, um, but I really like it. And it's wonderful for her as well. I showed you this. This organic um, all-purpose balm, I got a new one as well. But this one I've almost used up. This is also really nice. David often uses this. This has more of a neutrally natural kind of smell. It's not a sweet or anything it's it's more it's it's an interesting smell it's not bad um, it's more just neutral um, but this stuff is really 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 nice um, I like to use it on my legs sometimes um, just because I feel like it gives me a little bit of a shine on my leg because um, it's quite a bit more oily but in a good way um, so David also often uses this you know in really dry places on his elbows stuff like that so uh, I mean so far I would recommend everything that I've used this also the baby oil so nice I use this all the time after um, my baby girl has a bath I just smother her in the stuff oh amazing when she was really little she did battle with a little bit of that cradle cap and I didn't know what to do, but then I was like, well, I'm using this brand. Let me just try putting the oil in her hair. And I put the baby oil. I just did it a few days. I um, just rubbed it onto the skin. I didn't do anything to the cradle cap. I didn't, you know, scratch on it or anything like that. 
and it cleared right up it it really went away so I just I kept on oiling that spot in the front and um, it just in a matter of days it was gone and I had so many friends that were battling with the same thing and I, I said try the honest um, baby oil it got rid of her cradle cap so then their wipes I mean I've looked online before and every time I believe they've had the highest reviews and I 100% believe it and especially since they've changed a few months ago they changed to be a little more watery in a good way um, let me open this one it's a new one so the size is really large then they have these like ribs or I don't know they're kind of like little dots but it's not super smooth they've got like these little round rib kind of things and uh, it really helps to kind of capture the poo sorry it's true capture the poo um, they're really large and thick and they don't tear and I tried another baby wipe for something and I was when I like pulled whatever brand it was baby wipe out I thought oh my word this is what other brands baby wipes are like um, it was not impressive I was so used to the honest company I was actually spoiled um, I haven't found a better wipe just the yeah it just captures everything it's so large it's just really thick um, that was my friend who um, at first got me onto the the whole nappies and stuff that was one of her raving points as well that she said they have the best wipes and I can attest test is that the right word? well I can agree with that best wipes then one of my videos I did when I went to Costco and stuff because we also buy I buy the honest big body washes there Costco um, but on the subscription which I do have you can buy you know bundle like extra products at a discounted price and they also have bundles in there which are also a little bit more discounted so I just bought the it's a lavender bundle with the five products um, it comes with this 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 the body wash and the facial oil so five products I got um, in the bundle at a discounted and then rediscounted price Oh, so shampoo I mean the lavender one smells lovely as well um, honestly I actually did try the shampoo on myself the other day and I because um, I was waiting for new shampoo that I ordered um, and I found that my hair kind of just got greasy by the next day it was not yeah I just found like for me personally unless I'm washing my hair every day it was not doing everything that I needed and um, for Aries hair it works just perfectly fine David actually uses it and for him it works really well I have used their conditioner on myself and that was a really lovely conditioner for myself um, yeah this is just a different this is the lavender face and body lotion this is another bubble bath the lavender one which um, yeah it's also same lovely bubbles smells really good and then this is a I don't think I've tried this one the sweet orange vanilla um, the one thing I will say about the new this the new range of the almond I find it to be more creamy where the other range it seems a little more watery in a water-based way not that it's a bad cream at all I just really like the sweet almond because yes it, it just seems an extra moisturizing which I really really like and I think that's the point of it I think they developed it to be more moisturizing but I like the other creams as well then the facial oil um, I just got this so I'm excited um, to try this um, and then I've been wanting to try this for a long time I got the the magic beauty mark which I'm very excited to try they say you can put it anywhere in your top of your cheekbones wherever you want and just adds a little bit of moisture so this I'm very excited for everything else I've oh and this too the facial oil everything else um, I've tried and used and I really like it so yes my review on them stunning company I believe in what they believe in um, I believe in helping the environment really taking good ingredients and and using it for, for people um, I, I really do get quite a 
frustrated with companies that pretend to be healthy or pretend to be natural and they just aren't. Um, yeah, I, I think a lot of it, I don't know why they do it, part of me feels like because people are just greedy or something that they just misrepresent things because they find if they use cheap ingredients or fake ingredients um, to make more money, that's what I'm guessing. I don't know why else that they would lie or use bad ingredients. But the Honest Company, I, I do trust their ingredients, I do trust them. I think, I think they're really on the right, um, the right path. So that's my review. Would I recommend them? 100% yes. I, I really like the company, the customer service is fantastic. I think what they stand for is good. And um, I believe that they're really trying to be honest. I, I believe that they're trying to really use good ingredients and take care of the environment. So that's all. I just wanted to share that because I was ex so excited to get all this new stuff today. And I'm going to try my facial oil tonight and I'm going to try my beauty balm. And that's all. And thanks for watching. I will see you next time. Bye-bye.